been a little bit of a rough day. It um, started off great. I went, uh, I went swimming in uh, freezing cold, just gorgeous swimming hole called uh, Ormiston Gorge out in the McDonald Range. Unfortunately, while I was sitting at a cafe, uh, having a little bit of lunch, trying to get a few things done, I dropped my credit card in a crack between the table and the wall. We were unable to retrieve it. So even though uh, I'm really trying not to let it bother me, it, it's got me a little shaken actually, and it kind of set me up in a bad way. I didn't get all the way to Uluru today. That had been my plan. I'm probably another 200 kilometers away, and I am out in the middle of freaking nowhere. I, um, they recommend that I not drive at night because apparently there's lots of animals that cross the roads at night and uh, there's a huge number of casualties here in this part of the country because of animal animal hits in cars so I think I'm gonna heed that advice and um, call it a night it's it's absolutely stunning right here I'm watching the Sun right there and it's, it's beginning to set and um, you can see behind me there's very thorny grasses. I'm, I'm really hoping there's no snakes in there. But um, if you see me move really fast, that's what's happening. Um, there's a lot of cow poop around here, and there's a lot of cow prints, so I'm guessing this is a cow crossing. Permissible camping, so I'm gonna camp there for the night. There's a couple of other folks that are doing the same. And I'm gonna call it a call it an end of a day. So one of the lessons that I learned on the Great Ocean Walk was that I'm not going to let external circumstances decide my joy. And so on the road out here, I decided that getting to my destination wasn't important. What's important is for me to stop and in, right now and enjoy what I'm seeing. The spectacular sunset over the Australian outback. Another one of the lessons I talked about was return to Thanksgiving. When everything seems to go to hell in a handbasket, maybe that's the time to just stop and breathe and remember um, what is beautiful, what is good, what is amazing about the life that I'm living. And this, this is amazing. It's truly amazing.